Hi everybody, welcome to our first presentation for the Renewable Materials event today. And I'm delighted to introduce Bineke Posumus. Bineke is the Director of Business Development at Avantium. And today she will tell us about, um, introduce and tell us about their pl plant-based plastic material and the properties and values. Bineke, with that, the stage is yours. Thank you very much. Um, let me start with thank you, um, TechBlick, for giving me the opportunity to talk about PEF today. Um, um, and also thank you for the audience for, for joining um, and listening to uh, the story that I will be telling on, on PEF. Um, indeed, it's about the next generation uh, plant-based plastic with uh, unique properties, which I think is a great summary of, um, of PEF. So let me go into more detail um, about my presentation. Uh, but before talking about PF, um, I would like to set the scene uh, with the world that we're uh, facing today and the, uh, the challenge that we have for tomorrow. So in this um, uh, visualization, um, you see the, the current um, plastic production or current, I mean, the, the figure from 2018 and uh, the projection towards 2050 uh, towards um, the plastic need or the material need that we um, that we will have, um, looking at uh, demographic um, uh, growth and as a consequence uh, also the increase in demand for material usage. So if we want to go towards uh, meeting the demand of the market, uh, it is very clear that we have to um, do things in a different way, also considering the major environmental challenge that we have ahead of us. Uh, there are tougher regulations uh, towards um, uh, fossil-based plastics. Um, the industry commitments are um, uh, increasing towards uh, their sustainability goals. Um, and that means that we will um, not have uh, a sufficient um, uh, resources to be able to meet those demands, only looking at recycling or fossil-based plastics. Um, so that means that in the future, we need to go for other alternatives um, uh, to create a fossil free world. Um, part of that will be based on uh, bio-based materials, um, whereas uh, we see PF as a very good um, material in uh, that future picture. So um, I would like to introduce you um, towards uh, Avantium. And I think before really going to more about the details of Avantium, it's very important uh, to talk about, yeah, what is our company statement? And that is that Avant as Avantium, we create disruptive technologies and want to bring them to the world with partners to accelerate the transition towards renewable and circular products. So we are very much a technology company that works in partnerships to create a fossil free world. Avancium was founded about 20 years ago as, um, yeah, um, ironically, a spin-off from Shell. Um, but using that catalytic uh, knowledge that was part of that spin-out uh, very quickly to convert plant-based sugars into sustainable chemicals. And the past 20 years, uh, we've been uh, focusing very much on creating those fossil-free uh, fossil, uh, technologies. We have about um, uh, 135 patents on the different technologies uh, to create PF. Um, and throughout the years, we've made major progress towards the commercialization of our product. Some are being mentioned here on the timelines. Uh, for example, um, in 2017, when Avantium did, did an IPO in order to generate um, um, uh, financing to build uh, our first flagship plant, which will be operational in uh, two years time. Um, in addition, we have uh, created a joint venture to start producing uh, bio MEG. Um, and uh, in the future, um, we will start uh, with selling licenses of our uh, PF and um, uh, bio MEG technology to scale up production, but more about that later. Um, so for not for everyone, um, the um, yeah uh, the the world of uh, polymers is uh, very no well known. So I would like to give you a bit more background uh, on on um, what is PF, how it is made of, and what you can do with it. 